No study volunteers experienced a serious side effect, but more than half reported mild or moderate reactions such as fatigue, headache, chills, muscle aches, or pain at the injection site. This was found in Moderna Inc.'s experimental vaccine against SARS-CoV-2 for COVID-19 mRNA-1273. These were more likely to occur after the second dose and in people who got the highest dose, the team reported in the New England Journal of Medicine. Moderna was the first to start human testing of a vaccine for the novel coronavirus on March 16, some 66 days after the genetic sequence of the virus was released. The U.S. federal government is supporting Moderna's vaccine with nearly half a billion dollars and has chosen it as one of the first to enter large-scale human trials. A successful vaccine could be a turning point for Moderna, which has never had a licensed product. Moderna's shots when injected into people, the vaccine instructs cells to make proteins that mimic the outer surface of the coronavirus, which the body recognizes as a foreign invader and mounts an immune response against. The results released on Tuesday involve three doses of the vaccine, tested in groups of 15 volunteers aged 18 to 55 who got two shots, 28 days apart. The groups tested 250 micrograms of the vaccine. The team reported that individuals who got two doses of the vaccine had high levels of virus-killing neutralizing antibodies that exceeded the average levels seen in people who had recovered from COVID-19. According to Dr. Lisa Jackson, who leads the study, they didn't seek any events that are characterized as serious adverse events or reactions that require hospitalization or result in death. In June, Moderna said it selected the 100 microgram dose for its late stage study to minimize adverse reactions. Moderna said at that dose, the company is on track to deliver about 500 million doses per year and possibly up to 1 billion doses per year starting 2021. From the company's internal U.S. manufacturing site and strategic collaboration with Swiss drug maker Lonza. Dr. William Schaffner, a vaccine expert at Vanderbilt University Medical Center who was not involved in the study said, This is a good first step. A little fatigue and headache and myalgia and pain at the injection site is a small price to pay for protection against COVID-19, he adds. In April, Moderna expanded the Phase 1 trial to include adults over 55 who are more at risk of serious disease, with the aim of enrolling 120 volunteers. Moderna said it will follow to study volunteers for a year after the second shot, to look for side effects and check how long immunity lasts. Mariela Toza, UNTV News & Rescue We serve the people, we give glory to God.